What's up, everybody? Um, I'm still around. I'm just doing other things. You see, when I kind of stopped doing tech videos a while back, uh, I got into something that is more creatively fulfilling. I actually talked about this months ago that tech was kind of starting to get boring to me. And to be honest, I think I was right because if you look at what's going on right now, like I literally could look for what something interesting is to talk about right now and I could not find anything, like nothing. I think what I'm gonna do on this channel is I'm pretty much going to, you know, from time to time if something cool in tech happens, I'll probably drop a video here. It's just gonna be kind of rare. I mean, tech is really kind of boring. And the other thing is, with the economy not doing so well and the the projections at the beginning, at least of next year, is going to get even worse, I don't think tech is going to do very well view-wise. I really think uh, people are going to be saving their money for other things, and I don't think there's going to be a lot of views in tech next year. So it looks like I kind of started to make my exit at the right time. However, some of you have been asking in the comments where I've been and what am I doing. So I decided to show you. I'm going to show you one of the videos from my new channel, Travis Tries the World, I'm not going to link it here or anything because the way YouTube works is if too many of you go over there and you only watch tech videos, it screws it up. And then I got to start all over again. It, YouTube is dumb in this way. But for those of you that are interested and you want to see something kind of fun and funny, you can see what I've been doing lately. This one, I try to survive using only dollar store items for a week. And I'll tell you the quality of these videos that I'm doing on that channel. They're on a quality level you've never seen from me before. They are top level. So I hope you enjoy this from my channel, Travis Tries the World. And I'll see you guys and gals around uh, for other tech things another time. Peace and love. I'm about to go into the dollar store and see if I can survive for an entire week using only dollar store products. Anything I can buy in here that will replace something that I use during the normal part of my life, I have to use it. Now the question is, how am I gonna sleep using only dollar store products? Oh my God, my neck. No problem. Handy dandy. Night. All right, let's uh... Give her the old whiff. Oh! I wonder what a dollar bologna sandwich tastes like. It is heavy. It's like they put a brick in here. Why is it so heavy? And this is the dollar bologna. Hmm. Now the thing is, this doesn't have a zip deal. So once I open this thing up, it's the time limit starts. The time limit begins. Bologna sandwich. They made bologna for a normal grocery store and everything that fell off the manufacturing plant, they put that sumbitch together, crammed it together and put it in here for a dollar. Let's light this on fire. Let's take a smell. Nathan smelled it and he's leaving. Listen, I could do it for dramatic effect and tell you how this is terrible. It's not that bad. It's not something that you will go out and buy, but in a pinch, when someone pinches it off and you're in the bathroom, this will work. take a shower i'm going to use the dollar tree little spongy thing which by the way i've used those before there's nothing wrong with them and then uh their body soap uh come on you gotta be kidding me i basically smell like a 1980s cologne commercial Aramis, the impact never fades bruises are red violets are the best travis will now take a pregnancy test I'm either not pregnant or invalid. I need lunch. Uh, when you come to Fast Bites, you, you're not sure what you're gonna get. We gonna find out here in a second. The paper towels are from the dollar store and the plate is also. 
Luckily, I got more because they're for a dollar. <laughs> I also have to drink out of dollar store cups, which this isn't actually bad, but it's very thin. If you put this thing in your dishwasher, 100% this thing is going to melt. Let's go ahead and put some mix in here. Dollar store spoon. And this spoon isn't long enough to get to the bottom to mix it. Mmm, it's actually pretty good. Yo, that's hot! Dollar store chicken sandwich. Well, <clears throat> it's not that bad. Yes, the dollar store sells DVDs and Blu-rays. So this is my entertainment. I can't even watch movies on Netflix or YouTube because I was able to replace it with this. This is the one I wasn't looking forward to. Dollar store toilet paper. Bro. What the hell? How much do I have to use? 